Hello, everybody. We are back with more Zero Time Dilemma, going in to another D-Team root thing with these people. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna jump right in because honestly, I don't really remember what I was doing. No, I was doing, we did the room that had the walls that moved. <laughs> That's what we did last time. And now we're doing whatever this is. Outbreak. Well, that sounds pleasant. I'm sure this will be fine. Oh, the like robot room. Are these things robots? Yeah. Are they real? I doubt they're model toys. Hey! Hello? Why are you trying to talk She's to them? Friendly. It's probably just out of power. Still, why would these things be in this room? Looking around, I'd say they were being made here. Made? Yeah. Zero's probably manufacturing them. It why are there always like robots this room is or golems being made? On the map. Uh, um, Sigma, why did you get quiet all of a sudden? Oh, no reason. Damn. It's locked. Guess we're trapped in here. All right, so it is a puzzle Again? room. I thought so. Again? Diana, what time is it? It's 1810. There's no use wasting time in a place like this. Let's just find some way out of here. Okay, let's go. Okay. I wonder if anyone who plays these games keeps track of the times they say to make, like, <laughs> a timeline of events. Even though you can clearly, like, look at the flowchart or whatever. How do I? Okay. I was like, how do I move? Okay, let's, let's get bearings. First, we got the three robots. That one's literally, like, doing the robot. I don't know what that one is doing. Just slumping. Um... Got stuff there. Is that a taser? <laughs> what is that? I'm not gonna click it yet. Got a giant mixer without the bowl. Um, you got a claw machine without the claw. You got another mixer with sparkly bits. More sheets of paper. Uh big light bulb that says warning and high volt con con contactor okay all right where does my heart tell my heart tells me to go to the sparkles okay uh is this a lathe um what a lathe is that a machine tool for drilling holes in metal oh there's something here. I forget all the voices. What do you mean? This is just like a bit. Yeah, a screwdriver head. Why'd she have to use a fancy word? Nothing odd about this machine. Okay. What about these sheets of paper? What's this? Note three. Alex, Betty, Charlie. Oh, is this like letters, like spelling something? A, B, C? Or maybe you use actual names. Something's on the floor. White, red, blue. Okay. Oh, there's something written on it. Contact between the red and blue balls will result in an immediate, powerful explosion. Set the timer with the buttons above. I think this is a warning message. <laughs> you think it says warning on it? Oh, I see. Wait, this is a bomb? It 
What was Sigma's voice? I legitimately don't even remember. It explodes just from the blue and... What? Just It explodes just from the red and blue balls touching. Better keep our distance. Oh, I was like, what are you talking about? There's buttons. I don't know what you mean. It says start. What would this button activate? Why can't I read? <laughs> Uh, must be the button to start the bomb timer. Make sure you don't touch this one. That just makes you want to push it even more. No one's that dumb if it's a bomb, I hope. Wait, what did that note say? Wasn't it white? Was it white, red? Yeah, white, red, blue. Does that just mean these buttons? Looks like a stop button. Likely stops the timer on the bomb. Then we better remember that, just in case, you know? Oh, can I not interact with this? What? Oh, a time bomb? Why is something like this here? No clue. I don't think this comes standard in a nuclear shelter. Sierra must have prepared it. Just going on in his- what? Oh, <laughs> just what is going on in his head. Uh, okay, so I guess I'm not doing anything there. Let's go in order so I don't get confused. Um, hmm, this says a uh, high volt contactor. So then it's for activating something? Maybe for the robots behind it? They're all connected by cords. Seems so. If we can get some electricity to power this up. Okay, I'm gonna assume that I don't have to do anything there. Should I click the robots? Sure. What have you got? Each robot here looks a little different from the other ones. Hmm, probably prototypes. I can see a bit of trial and error going on in these- in the designs. So, the ones made later are better than the early ones? That is typically what prototypes are, but you know, maybe not. Looks like a robot. Thanks. <laughs> uh, the framework of all of them looks the same. You're right, maybe they were all made by the same person. This one's got like hair. <laughs> a helmet. It's a robot, right? Is is it going to move? Maybe it's just for display. No, I think it'll move with power. We just need to figure it out. Okay. Can't do anything till you power it. Got it. Oh, there's more like claw machines. Oh, and there is a claw <laughs> right there. Cut Charlie. <laughs> It says, cut Charlie. What did Charlie do? Oh no. Okay. Cut Charlie. Hey look, this is some kind of blueprint. God, what does that say? Dummy color? Roof? Blue? White? Close now? Surveillant? What? Timer circuit. Why is it so blurry like that? Maybe you're just not supposed to read that. <laughs> that is a taser. Uh, this looks like some kind of tool. Okay, combine. Wow. A screwdriver. Oh, it's a stun gun. Huh? Well, why would that be here? Is this gonna be our power? <laughs> Stun one of the robots, see if it turns on. There's a handwritten note. Oh, what does it say? From the far left, four right, one left, two left, four right, three, what? <laughs> what in the? From the far left. 
Is this like the claw machines, maybe? Let's pick everything up first. Oh, what's this? A blueprint for something? It says cut Betty on it. Not Betty, too. We just lost Charlie. Okay. Uh, there's nothing left on it, thank you. Diana. I never would have been able to see that myself. I don't think this machine is working. Uh-huh, this is... Alright, this is to cut Betty and Charlie. I wonder if... It's Betty, Charlie, and whatever, what, whatever the other one is in here. I don't think I've seen anything else. Can I click this? Oh, I can. There's a crane up there. I'm sure we can use it to lift something. But I don't see anything we need to lift. We'll come back to this when we need it. Alright. Is there anything... that I have not clicked on before I try? Well, what about this stuff? What's this for? Hmm, I don't know. Let's not touch it. Who knows what would happen. Or it might just be decoration. Are they acknowledging that <laughs> some of the stuff in the background is just decoration <laughs> for the room? Uh, a strange machine. We don't know how to use it, so we'll leave it alone. Alright. <laughs> I'll ignore that then. What is this? The red and blue balls are inside. Oh, what? Oh, inside are the bomb. They'll explode when they collide together. Oh, I thought the balls they were talking about were on the... Oh, well, whatever. It's dangerous to mess with this now, so let's leave it alone. What do you mean? <laughs> huh? It's a warning message, yes. Looks slow when they collide. Uh, hello? <laughs> what? What? Um. Okay, well, what did Betty and Charlie look like? And which notes were they? <laughs> Cut Charlie. Charlie looks like a Y or a T. I don't know if I've seen any of this anywhere. What are these? Strange machine, we don't know how to use it. What about, like... The voltage contactor... The cords are connected to the robots, activate some... It might run if we get some electricity through... Maybe if I touch it with this... Okay, I thought, we just, I thought they were just gonna say the same thing. How about using the stun gun? What? I never thought of that. Who knows if it'll work, but let's give it a shot. What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what? Oh, that didn't work. It's reacting to the stun gun, so we know that's right. We just need to know the order. <laughs> the correct order. Oh, didn't we find it? Yes, we did. <laughs> uh, which one was it? No. 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 There. Uh. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. Let me write these down so that I don't have to try to memorize let's see we got four, 
It's confusing that they have arrows there. <laughs> pointing to each one, too. Four right, one left, two left, four right, three left. Now, does this mean, like, oh, from the far left? Okay. From left. No, am I supposed to, like, continue on from where I left off with each of these? Or is it all going to be from the far left? I'll just try. I'll just try. Okay, so from the left, go four right. One, two... Oh, I guess it is from where you le leave off because you can't go one left from the... Okay, one, two, three, four. And then one to the left. Two to the left. One, two, three, four. To the right, I might be doing this wrong. And three left. One, two, three. And then it said boot up. No? Okay, I did something wrong. I, I messed up somewhere. Oh, I got it wrong again. From the far left, four right. Yeah, one, two, three, four. But then do you count the one? Hold on, let me look at that again. Which one was it? Okay, <laughs> boot up. So wait, this is one, two, three, four, five. There are six here. Okay. I must have just uh, messed up somewhere. Am I supposed to go like one, two, three, four, and then like, uh, mm -hmm. I feel like I'm just gonna do the exact same thing. One, two, three, four. One. One, two. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this is just gonna be the exact same thing. What am I missing here? Stop repeating the same thing. <laughs> That's not helpful. Uh... From the far left, yes. Unless I count the far left one as me being on it. As in, like, consider it... Uh, already electrocute, so I would go one, two, three, four, then one, one, two, and then one, two, three, four, then one, two, three, and then boot up. No. What? From the far left, four right, one left. Okay, let me try doing it a different way. One, two, three, four. But if I go one, f okay, one from the left, two from the left, then three from the right, no. No, it's four from the right, I guess. So this doesn't work. This doesn't work. This doesn't work. Is this really the only puzzle that I'm allowed to do right now? <laughs> do they really just lock me into this? I have a screwdriver and things to cut, but I don't think I have anything to screwdrive or cut right now. Ah. <sighs> 
How does this happen to me? I make the mistakes. I mess up. And I can't solve the puzzle. Did I write it down wrong? Like let me let me let me double check. <laughs> Four right. One left. Two left. Four right. Three left. That is exactly what I wrote. From the far left. I do not get it. I do not understand. I didn't mean to click that. <laughs> um... I feel like the way that I'm doing it should be correct. And if it's not correct, then I'm upset. Let's go the opposite way. Maybe they're being stupid and it's from like the robots left. Okay, I'm glad that's not it, because I would have I would have been mad. <laughs> I'm still gonna be mad, but why is this game like this? What is this? Activate in the correct order. It is the most assuredly safer. What? It is the most assuredly safer. What? <laughs> To use the stun gun on the contactor than yourself. The correct order is capable of activating the robot. What is this <laughs> sense? Uh, controls. Click the contactor the stun. <coughs> okay. Wow, thank you. I could have never figured it out unless you told me. From the far left. <laughs> four right, one left, two left, four right, three left. Unless I go like, I click this. Like this is from the far left includes a click. And then I go one, two, three, four. One. One, two, one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three. I hate this game. <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> this game is so dumb. <laughs> Stop it. Yes, I think this will work. Yeah, huh? Hey, look, robots. What the f <laughs> doing well all three of them are activated <laughs> then they're in strange poses well I just hope they won't try to hurt us they can't the laws of robotics the laws of robotics okay <laughs> so dumb <laughs> I hate this why am I playing this okay what do you want Okay, it started up fine. What? Pleasure to meet you. I am Alex. What's wrong with it? Is it broken? Maybe it's simply an older model? Wait, who do I need to cut? I need to cut Betty and... Charlie? Is that it? Which one are you? Hey, hey, Betty. I am Betty. Hey, hey. Nice to meet you all. Hooray. I like Betty. Betty's my favorite. Well, what's up with this one? It's strangely hyper. No, no, no. Anger, put down. Set timer to zero seconds, please. Hey, I think it's angry? Set the timer to zero seconds? What does it mean? Can I cut you? Set us up the bomb timer to zero seconds. Set, set, please. Are you stupid? Yes. Yes, Betty. 
I am. Well met. My name is Charlie. I'm only saying this once, so listen up. It, it's more fluent than I expected. It's so human. His tone of voice could use some work. What's with the staring? Could you be any bruder, human? What did this accomplish for us? <laughs> Has this accomplished literally anything? Okay, I didn't I didn't talk to Alex twice. I am Alex. It is my utmost pleasure. Okay. Did, what about the cords? Can I cut the What do you want from me? Do I gotta unscrew you? Oops. Do you got something I can unscrew? Yes, Alex. I know. I know. It's your pleasure. It's your pleasure. It's my pleasure too, Alex. Goodbye. Betty. Okay. Charlie. 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 Um, <laughs> okay. What about this? How did I not see that? <laughs> Only this section of the floor is different. I wonder if there's something to it. Below the floor storage? But I don't see a handle. It's bugging me too, but we should search other places right now. Dude, where? Point me in the direction? I'll search. <laughs> where do you want me to go? What is that? Can I do these now? The red and blue balls inside. Let's try what? Let's try not to touch the controller. What do you want from me? What do you want? I am so confused. What the f what? Sorry, I skipped all of that because I thought it was just them babbling. What is that? I don't even know what I clicked that was different. <laughs> the detonation box. Betty has activated the timer inside the box just now. The ignition signal will transmit in five minutes. Five minutes? Damn it, I knew it. We should have never listened to that robot. It can be disarmed if you choose. You only have to cut the correct wires inside. Don't pick the wrong one. The hints to the right wires should be left by the designer. So we only have to cut the correct wires in the detonation box? Does that mean there's a blueprint around here? Yes, we have it already, Sigma. Let's hurry, there's no time. Okay, now what did you guys actually say? What did you guys actually say? Um... Like, which part did I click that wasn't... Uh... I'll start the button. Oh, it's a start button. The red and blue balls are inside, but it doesn't look that dangerous. Something's stopping them from moving, but who knows what could knock this over. I've seen toys like this, but we don't have enough lives to play around with this one. And this is a bomb timer display. It's set for 300 seconds, but it's not counting down right now. The button that sets the time. Betty said set timer to zero seconds. Eh, why not? Well, wait, are we actually doing what it said? Zero could be controlling it. But we don't have any other clues. Yeah, but we don't know what'll happen. True. Only God knows. I'm going to set it to zero seconds. What is that? <laughs> okay. I probably clicked the, like, top of it. But it's, like, s difficult to see what's in there to, <laughs> to even know what to click. Okay, what's going on? Uh, the detonation box. We only have to disarm this thing, right? Yeah, we've got to cut the wire and then take the cover off. There's a red wire and a blue one. I'm guessing we shouldn't cut one of them. Uh, no, then which one do we cut? 
Oh. Wait. Hello? Can I not unscrew it? Let's cut the wire first. We have to do it sooner or later. Hello? White, red, blue. Cut Charlie. Does this say anything? Cut Betty. Is it the left one? Mm, I can't tell. <laughs> I can't tell if... Oh, that's not it. I can't tell if this is a diagram of that. I don't think it is. Doesn't look like that. But it could be if the... Why can't I do a side-by-side? -side? Let me do a side-by-side, -side, please. Which one is Betty? Betty is purple. Aren't they? Neither of those are <laughs> purple. Oh, well, they've got like blue on them. Maybe I'll just I'll just cut the blue one. I don't even care. Okay, I'm going to cut the blue wire. All right, I'm counting on you. All right, goodbye. Bye. What's happening? It's going to explode? Shit, it wasn't blue. Look, er, what? <laughs> Look, that device began to move. What? No good. If the balls collide, they'll explode. We need to make sure they don't. Oh, was I supposed to get it wrong? Were they both wrong? What am I supposed to do? God. <laughs> Oh, dude, this is like that old game. What, what's it called? Like, flow or whatever? Where you arrange pipes in a specific direction and the stuff, like, moves. You know? You know. Someone will know. <laughs> oh, good. We avoided the collision somehow. I'll admit, I was worried. So this thing starts moving if we fail to disarm the box? Seems like it. We need to be more cautious. But I want to do those! Can I just do those instead of cutting the stupid wires? I cut the wrong one. And how would I- how would it- how would it- how would I know? <laughs> how would I know? Was it the squiggle that was on the red one? In that diagram? I don't know. I cut the wrong one. Now we only have to cut the red wire and remove the screws. See it like- Was this the indicator? <laughs> Cause there's nothing being like, this one is Betty. It just says cut Betty. Betty's not red. <laughs> I don't get it. Only the red wire's left. We can cut this one, right? Yeah, the robot did say cut the right wire. Yeah, and I cut the right wire. <laughs> that, <laughs> that means we don't- wait, what? We won't be done until this- oh my god, just go <laughs> cut it. Mm -hmm, nothing's happening, like we thought. Oh good, I was a little worried. Why did we need to- why couldn't we have unscrewed the screws before cutting the wire? Were we assuming it would explode? I'm guessing so. Now we only have to take off the screws. Cool, where's my screwdriver? Okay. Yes, we disarmed it. Now we just need to remove the screws from- Okay, look, you guys- I know it's good to celebrate small victories, but maybe wait <laughs> until we get through. Okay, the cover's off. I knew it. The blueprints and notes were clues disarming this. Damn, so that's what they meant. If only we'd noticed earlier. I did notice, but I didn't know what it was saying. <laughs> Bye. 
There is still something inside the detonation box. Let's not make another mistake. Huh? What the... Is that thing staring at me? It has no eyes, Sigma. It is an old model. Maybe it feels an affinity. Please, take this. And then he punches him. Oh. What do you got? What? <laughs> okay. What does he have in his hand? Is that a note? I thought he was just like holding out his hand. <laughs> Cut Betty. We already got- we- uh, I got it. Thanks. Alex gave us a note. Cool. Cool. Um, what did the other one- what did the other- Uh, what did the other one say? Okay. See, like, is this the cut symbol? Cut this one? It's so weird. Okay. Let me see what this looks like first. The box isn't completely disarmed yet. We need to check inside. It's not a fuse this time. It's hammers and a pendulum? I think this is the thing, but I can't tell what it's... What it's... Uh, I get the feeling we shouldn't let the hammers touch the pendulum. We can't get at anything with the glass plate here. Let's take the screws out first. Was that... Was... Okay. Oh! No! A hammer hit the pendulum! Hello? I didn't know what... Okay. Look. Listen. I like the other games, so I wanted to do that. <laughs> I'm giving myself a challenge. <laughs> Damn it, causing vibrations along the pendulum is definitely not good. Look, the device there started to move. What happens if I fail this? Do I just die and have to do the room all over? Okay. All right, quick thinking, quick thinking. Where are we going? What are we doing? Oh, I messed up. Already. I messed up already, I think. No, I didn't. I got you. <laughs> got him. See, why can't these be like the main puzzles and then you have to do whatever the other thing is <laughs> if you get it wrong? Uh, I was frightened. I couldn't keep up with it. Okay, let's concentrate harder on the next one. All right, what the frick do you want? <laughs> the hammer hit the pendulum. The pendulum touches the ring. Then we need to be more careful next time. What am I trying to do? Hold on, let me actually look at what they said again. Pendulum touches the ring. What? If a pendulum touches the ring up top, the fuse gets triggered. If a pendulum touch- if the pendulum touches the ring up top. So what am I doing? Like, actually, what am I trying to accomplish here? I unscrewed this one first, so I don't want to do that. Like, the thing is, it's hard to tell what'll happen here. Like, this hits that hammer. So it hit that hammer and then hit the pendulum? Is that what happened? So what I need to do is unscrew this, maybe? And then it'll just hit that other screw. Okay, and then I can unscrew that one? Okay. And then I can probably safely unscrew those. Um, so... This just hits that. 
Do I do this one first? <laughs> like, is there a difference between doing either of these? Let me do this one first. Okay. What happens if I do this? Nothing. This. See, now I don't know. Do I want it to hit this eventually? I'm assuming not, right? So do I do this? Won't it hit it? Oh, okay. Okay, whatever. Uh, what? <laughs> okay, we removed all the front screws. Oh, I was so nervous. Once we remove the screws, we'll be able to take this thing off. These screws? Completed. Who's ready to cut the wrong wire? Okay, uh... Ah, uh, good. The triggers around the pendulum are gone. My heart stopped a few times. Hey, look at the box. There's still something in there. What? Damn, we don't even get a break. How much time do we have left? Oh, I forgot there was a timer. Hello? <laughs> I love lamp. I drink your milkshake. I am Spartacus Geronimo. Hee hee hee. Woo. <laughs> what? What in the world is wrong with this thing? When did it move here? We don't have time for this right now. We have to disarm this box first. All right. The thing could just like murder you. And you're concerned with the... Have we even been using these? Maybe it's just assumed that we've been using them. This one's uh, Charlie, right? This wire set. Well, it seems like we haven't completely disarmed it yet. What? Another red or blue choice? Uh, again? What should we do? We'll look at the note. That's the wrong note. <laughs> That's also the wrong note. See, like, is this the thing? Is it, does it say this? So the right one? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put uh, what? <laughs> I'm gonna cut the blue wire, okay? Do it. Nothing's happening. So I guess it was that. It was the squiggle on it. it was supposed to indicate cut. For some reason. Even though it wasn't like really squiggled. If there was like a dotted line, maybe I don't know something that isn't just that. Uh, looks like that was the correct choice. And now... what? Now we only have to take off the screws. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yes, we disarmed the fuse. Now we only have to remove the screws. Do what is the difference? What was the difference <laughs> between doing the bottom ones and the top one? Maybe I'm just missing something. Yes, it's off. The blueprints and notes were the clues to disarm this. Huh? Hold on. There's still something in the back of this box. We're not out of this yet, huh? Okay, let's hurry. We don't have much time. Yeah, that robot is about to mess you up. What? Nobody puts baby in a corner. Corner? Here's Johnny. I'm the doctor. Who? Who? Haha, <laughs> time. <laughs> what? Uh, hey, hey, that thing moved again. Um, it doesn't look like the robot's- doesn't it look like the robot's going to do something? We have to focus. We have to disarm. But oh, we have- we have to disarm? We have more to disarm! That's the other... one. This one. Where you can't tell what it's showing you to do. Cool! Love it. Time to cut wires. Three of them. Well, what should we do? Which wire do we cut? Hey, stop hesitating. We don't have the time. You have what? 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 Why? Who is telling me this? What is happening? You have one last wire to cut. You know? 
<laughs> Why is it singing? The rest are dummies and will explode when cut. Who was saying that? <laughs> Who just said that? What? He's saying so suddenly. Is this one of the robots? Cut the timer wire. The one with the oldest memory has the answer to which one it is. What are you talking about? Are you talking about Alex saying cut Charlie? Or was it cut Betty? What did they say? Oh, I get it. That's a hint. The one with the oldest memory. Does that mean the oldest one? Don't you dare. <sighs> cut Betty. How do I know which one is Betty? Which one was Betty? I don't remember the colors, and this doesn't tell me. Does it just mean cut the left? Betty was red, right? I'm gonna just assume it's the left one. Is this really the right one? Yes, if I'm right, then red the... I'm gonna cut it. <laughs> okay. But then I don't get to do the other puzzle. Wait, that was it? What? Okay. That was odd. <laughs> there was puzzles that you didn't even need to do. <sighs> Seems like it went all right. Let's go. I wanted to do the other We've one. Been in this I should have failed on enough. purpose. <laughs> There was also a note that said, like, white, red, blue, or whatever. Like, what were those notes for? Do they Where's help at Gab? all? Where's Gab? Maybe Where is Gab? Where is Gab? Where is Gab? Oh, right, yeah. I'll go and check in the prep room. Why there? Well, he could be coming through the air vent. Where's Gab? Why would they bring attention to Sina, Gab not being there? Did those oh. robots cause you to remember? Was something? it just to get rid of Fly? The robots? <laughs> so that the they could talk in front of the crate? The <laughs> we started acting so strange after we entered that room. Gotta have our chat in front of the crate. It's our water cooler. I've made a few before in the past. You made robots? Well, I mean all I really made was the outer appearance. And the AI. Isn't the frame that the robot? Was built somewhere else. Okay. <laughs> Why did you make them? It's a long story. Let's just say that it was vital to the completion of my plan. No, maybe that's not quite true. It could have just been my cover. To tell the truth. I was simply lonely. I spent several decades of my life alone in the middle of a desolate desert. I lived in a facility built deep it's underground. It's a tiny basketball hoop. Much like this shelter is. Sometimes an acquaintance stopped by. But is it? That was it? Maybe it's not small. No calls, Maybe it's just an illusion. Even emails. It was a place of complete and utter quiet. No rain, no wind. Just a buzz that echoed in my ears. Sigma's constantly. feet are also really big compared to Still, Diane's. Still, it wasn't as if I was all alone at the start. I am listening. Someone also. <laughs> was there to help me for a short while after I started living at the facility. Where does that vent go? A woman. Sorry. She was very lovely, kind and gentle. Her name was, well, let's just call her Dee. Dee and I, we lived together for three years. We spent the time researching genetics and studying various subjects like quantum mechanics, cosmology, biochemistry, and artificial intelligence. Wait, are you talking about that? But the woman passed away. Why? Why? <laughs> the facility's environment was very particular. To be brief, it had weak gravity. As a result, an illness developed within her circulatory system. My grief overwhelmed me. 
two, three years passed, and, and the pain was as fresh as ever. So that's why the robots... I recreated Dee's appearance as best I could. Yeah, he is talking about her. I made her thought her. patterns match as close as possible. I spent 25 years completing her. And of course, it was impossible to perfectly replicate everything about D. But still, she ended up pretty close. For a robot. I named her Luna. Luna was very devoted to me. I also found that I truly loved her. Not as a woman, but more like a daughter. Do you hate me? No, I'd never. What? I'm just really confused. <laughs> what? He is being very confusing. Sigma, how old are you? I'm 67. You oh, right. No. They they forget every time. You I must forgot. Be joking. <laughs> hey, Diana, Sigma, come here. Is Gab okay? If something's wrong with Gab, I'm not playing this game anymore. What is it? I've come up with a plan. Dude, a plan. don't scare me. Would you bring out the map, Diana? What map? What's oh. beyond the decontamination room? <laughs> the hall for the elevator. So that would mean? If we open this door, we can get out of here? But how would we get it open? It's welded shut. Nothing less than a bomb would manage to dent it. Yeah, do then, we just have a bomb? Let's use one. What? Let's just use a bomb, and boom, the door will be blown away. Wait, you don't mean... The light bulb. If I remember right, we only need to set the timer and press the start button? Correct. Once the timer ends, the red and blue balls are released. When they both touch, that's when it explodes. Yeah. Okay. Get to it, Sigma. Huh? The two of us. Oh, the crane. We'll see you back in the lounge. Right? Maybe? Wait a second. I don't know. You want me to Maybe carry not. it by myself? Men lift the heavy stuff. It's been the way of things since olden times. I'm the old one. But your body's 22, right? Why can't you all help? Don't forget to be careful moving it, okay? If those two balls touch early, we're goners. Diana and I won't have a way out anymore. Your concern for me is touching. Okay, let's go, Diana. Oh, um, okay. Real? All right, rude. <sighs> Diana taking the stun gun? Is she gonna stun someone? What's happening? Oh. All set to go. <laughs> Congratulations. I thought someone was being attacked or Who something. Who the hell you head angle? Call me Boss Fi. When did you get so high and mighty? Since birth. Your parents must have been real characters. Please, you two. More importantly, looks like the timer can only go up to 300 seconds. Five minutes, huh? Five minutes is plenty of time to get enough distance. All right, I'm gonna push the button now. Are you all ready? Yeah. Ready when you are. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. It just explodes. <laughs> Where are we? They didn't run very I far. Think this is far did they? How much time is left? I would have ran four farther. Minutes, Thirty sec. <laughs> no, twenty seconds. Now announcing the current casualties: C.T. Carlos, Akane, Junpei. 
Okay, so they died in the the thing. Do I have their words? Their X passes. I think I have those already. That is all. Fire crash five. How? The execution. What? You forgot? Yeah. Diana picked C team during the vote at 1330. Wait, what are you saying? Diana chose to vote for Q team. Isn't that right? Oh, they're gonna remember different things again and have an argument. What kind of nonsense are you trying to pull? What? Did you really believe that I wouldn't notice? Zero. What do you mean? What you're doing right now is considered a rule infraction. What rule? You are not allowed to leave by means other than the X door. Is that a rule? Did we get a that rule book? Is one of the game rules. We never heard that rule before. As such, I decided I must break the rules as well. Yeah, you can't is on the other side of the have... examination room at this moment. Oh. They lie unconscious from being injected with the anesthetic and the bracelets. Cool. Also, you can't just have rules and just then not so tell people know, what the rules are. The that makes for a dumb it's true game. That if it detonates, the door in the decontamination room will be blasted apart just as you have planned. At the same time, that means the deaths of the oblivious slumbering Q team. So, but then we get to leave, right? <laughs> there are three minutes left. You can stop. I'm sure Q will be fine. Q team, or leave them to die and make your own escape. The choice is yours. Hey, wait, Diana! What? <laughs> that was a like acid shower or whatever, what right? What the hell was that? I think it's liquid hydrogen fluoride or hydrofluoric acid. The hydrofluoric acid? It's a powerful acid that can even melt glass or metal. How do you know that? I know because I just do. Didn't she nurse? It doesn't Didn't matter. she study stuff? It's definitely <laughs> some kind of acidic liquid. There's no way we can get inside. This is... A protective suit. We can go in if we put this on. But there's only one. So Diana's gonna go, because she's the one that I'll I'm controlling. It. No, Diana. But if someone doesn't go in, Q-Team will... Then I'll go. No, I won't let you. Stop it. We're already too late. Even if someone gets the suit on, we won't make it in time. Come on. Let's get out of this room. There's no other way. Saying Sigma. Am I making a choice? What's going on? <laughs> oh, is okay. Weird. Also weird how there isn't a timer. Um, hmm. What would I do? I don't know what I would do. <laughs> I don't know what I would do. How well do I know these other people on Q team? Am I gonna risk myself to save them? Hmm. But we don't know where Gab is. What if Gab's on the other side? Okay, let we can't run. Gab could be there too. He didn't say that Gab was there, but what if Gab's there? I don't want Gab to get hurt. I'm sorry about this, Sigma. <laughs> I forgot she had the stun gun. Diana, you. Fi, I have a request. Take Sigma to the surface. I can't. So you're saying you can't do it? Then I have no choice. 
Wait, what are you doing? This. What's the point of that? I mean, I guess she thought they would stop her? <laughs> what was that? I have to hurry. Why do they have to make it so realistic? No. <laughs> With the voice. Also, how would the acid not disintegrate the bomb? It said it could melt through like glass and metal and stuff. So. You know? <laughs> How? Okay. Now we gotta... Uh... Yeah, I'll do the other one. Will I do the... I already saved. No. Go back. I'll do the other one. Why not? Why not? Let's do the other one. We have time. We're running away this time because we're assuming Zero. that Gab is fine. And that Zero could be lying. Sigma He's going in? Still in there. <laughs> Why? Sigma! Sigma! Was that what the sound of doing? him locking Open the door? door? How do you lock that I kind of door? Do what do like you a mean? Key sound. <laughs> you would have tried to hold me back if I said I'd go, right? You lied? Anyway, there's no time. You both need to get as far yeah, away as you can. Yeah, there isn't time. Stop messing so. around. You're just gonna die. That's not it. It's just in case. I won't die. I will save everyone in Q team. What? So. Sigma! It's Sigma! just in case Sigma! I won't die. What does that mean? Huh? Literally no point. But okay. I'm confused. Oh, uh, I'm not confused no. anymore. <laughs> Sigma. So wait, is this the re wait? Huh? Sigma, Sigma, hang on. Is this the real timeline then? Oh my God. We, we need to get him medical attention. She is the medical attention. I'll go check the other room. Is this the canon timeline? Because Sigma doesn't have arms in the actual one. Unless this is a fake out. Because if this is the canon... Okay. No, that doesn't make sense. Because it's Ikane and... and the door's gone. Junpei are dead. We're getting out of here. Come on. What'd she say? <laughs> Oh, was that 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 was where the explosion happened? No. What Please is going no. on in this? Oh, it's an elevator. Oh, they were dead from something else. Why? Don't worry. That's not an explosion death. This child. Why such a small child? 
They're probably uh, fine. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Hey, are you all right? Why? Where are the others? I see. Oh, that was her. Is that made the noise. Nice? I'll be joining them soon. <laughs> Zero told us. It was you, wasn't it? You set the bomb. They don't they don't look like they That's were hurt okay. by an explosion. You deserve something nice and like return. at all. <laughs> oh, is that what? radical six or whatever? What did you just inject me with? Maybe you've heard of it. That virus. If someone infected with the virus was to go outside, then mankind, six billion people, will die. What did you? Well, do you like it? My present to you. Wait! She only had a singular wound. How'd she die? Q also didn't have like any visible wounds. And Eric just looked like he was like punched in the mouth hard. What happened? Okay. No. <laughs> I thought they were in that. I was like, what? Uh, who knew this would happen? My body like this. Fi injected with radical six. Yeah, who knew this Everything would happen? Points to a single truth. What truth? It seems this history is the one that connects to that future. But it said that Akane is dead, well, and so is Junpei. I guess but Fai they're alive. The past. So. Diana, so. You must not use this lift. What are you saying? We need to get you to a hospital as soon as possible, or... Don't worry about me. No. The two of you need to get out of here. I am the only one who should stay. There's no point. The rescue team will eventually show up if Diana and I get to the surface. And you know, they'll come down and get you too. Then... kill me. Kill me and burn my remains. Now! Why? There's no other way. That's the only way to keep the virus from spreading. <sighs> Come on, hurry. Six billion lives are on the line. Why are you asking someone I, else to I do can't. that? Do it yourself. There's no way I can't do that. Diana, you, you know what you're doing, right? Yes, I do. I'm going to save you and Fi. I'm confused. Oh, there's more? <laughs> hey! Can you hear me? What's going on? Hello? This is Control. I repeat, this is Control. Please come in. I'm asking you to respond. This is Diana. Six of us are. Oh, dead. is this that like audio that's in the Counting myself, other game? There are only three left. 
Is it? They were Actually, killed. I don't remember what it sounded like. I... I guess you could say... I killed them. No. No, that's not quite right. Not just them. Not just these Except six. Except you didn't? What All are you of talking them. about? <laughs> All six billion. Soon, I will have killed six billion people. I suppose this was meant to be. But this doesn't make Let's sense. Let's put our hope <laughs> in the next Sigma. The me who will return here from the future. How does Junpei get there? How does Akane get there? Is this credits? What's happening right now? This is just a black screen. Hello? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I was like, what? Let me out. A rabbit in my future. But it doesn't um, It'll... I'll... It'll probably make sense later. Maybe? Maybe. Unless they have a giant... Um, plot hole <laughs> in their like canon quote unquote ending. I got like so I don't remember what the purpose of them like going back here is. Is it to like change to a different future? So is that just like the canon timeline for the future that is VLR? And even if it is, how. How are there others still alive? I... Doesn't make sense. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. But we did all the roots that are in that area. That thing. And we got an actual unending. We got an ending. Which I, I assume is Diana's ending. So we've had Mira's and Diana's. Wow. So... That was the new one that like popped up, so we're not doing that one next. Um, we're gonna do the gun next. This confusing looking one with a bunch of choices. You love to see it. I love to see choices. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm still a little confused by that. Also, I want to check something. There's a lock there. It was brought up that there's like a border around some of them and not around others. And I'm just seeing if it means... Yeah, it looks like it means like the ones with a border are fully completed. And the ones without uh, still have like something to do. Which, why does this one... I don't know why this one doesn't have a border, but... Um... Yeah, anyway, next time... The gun? We'll find out. 